Well, the bird migration is a, an international phenomenon and uh, sometimes uh, birds have to suffer somewhere along their migration routes and uh, here in the north in Europe we are very sensitive to uh, migratory birds uh, having barriers on their way, be natural barriers but also human barriers and as far as uh, hunting is concerned we get uh, even more sensitive. Unfortunately we also sometimes forget that the situation in, uh, let's say, Africa is different than in uh, Europe. And um, so we uh, maybe sometimes put too much emphasis on uh, our birds being uh, killed and eaten by them uh, down there. We have to think about the situation in Africa. Uh, people still are hungry have to feed their family, maybe they eat some of the birds, they sell some more uh, to buy uh, things they really need for their family. So we have to think about that. But uh, fortunately we have international conventions, we have uh, the Bonn Convention that is caring for migratory animals and within the Bonn Convention uh, we have um, different agreements, action plans for birds, now at the moment developing an action plan especially on land birds of the African Eurasian region and I think this problem should uh, fit very well into this action plan and uh, I saw that uh, we find solution that uh, we can save birds, we can have um, bird populations in a, a satisfying conservation status but at the same time uh, permit a certain harvesting of uh, the birds on their migration routes to feed hungry people and to help them carry uh, the load of uh, sometimes uh, numerous uh, family. If we think about the situation in poor countries where people sometimes depend on wildlife, on wild animals passing through their countries or living in their countries, we can also think about the bushmeat problem uh, further south in Africa. When we think about that, um, we can of course uh, help to find uh, solutions uh, in order to um, have these people um, uh, behaving in a, in a way that they sustainably use uh, the wildlife uh, they are depending on. So there are probably alternatives we can uh, uh, offer them to their livelihoods, like um, favoring uh, tourism, where they could earn some money instead of selling um, wildlife they have uh, caught, maybe killed, they could uh, profit from people just taking photographs of, of the same wildlife. And of course, capacity building, education in general, is a very important issue in uh, most. Uh, biodiversity related uh, conventions because educating people, educating women, giving women the possibility of uh, um, caring for their family uh, is a way to developing knowledge to have their children also um, becoming aware of the situation they live on and they live in and uh, being more um, cautious and con uh, concerned about the um, sustainability of uh, their life.